Okay guys, so the day has come. Today is the day, the big flight for Cahill. Total of around 10 to 12 hours from Entebbe International Airport, Uganda to Suwanapum Airport, Bangkok, Thailand. Ayun. So, papakita ko lang sa inyo ang mga uh, napako para sa kanya. This is to help other parents out there who are going to have uh, the, their first experience sa um, unassisted, sorry, first experience ng unassisted minor flight. Ayun. So, just to be clear, ito yung first time din namin. First time kong itry at first time ng tatay ni Kahil na itry to. But we heard a lot of um, stories already about this and the airlines do them a lot. From the age of 6 up to 11, uh, they have to fly as an assisted minor kapag wala silang kasama. Pero by the age of 12, they can fly as adult. First things first, uh, paano ko nga ba na-book yung unassisted minor? Uh, ang unang ginawa ko is to visit the main office ng airline na gagamitin ni Kahil. So I spoke to them, I asked them how it goes, humingi ako ng idea, ng information, direct from the office. Hindi ako nagbasa online. So the office was in Kampala at mas panatag yung loob ko guys dahil talagang nakausap ko sila at natanong ko lahat ng mga gusto kong itanong. So basically, ang ticket ng isang unassisted minor uh, falls under adult fare plus uh, we had to pay a service fee para sa pag-assist nila sa bata in every uh, airport, air, uh, in every airline, departure, and of course, sa arrival. Ayun. So, um, ang prices ay nakadepende sa ticket, no? hindi magkatulad. So, ang kay Kahil ay paid his flight and the unassisted minor somehow falls in the bracket of price na 100 US dollar to 150 US dollar per flight. So, in total, ang nabayaran ko for assisting Cahill um, is around 250 US dollar. So, sobrang dali lang. Of course, going there, I had to, going to the ticketing office, the main branch, I had to carry his passport. Kailangan nilang makita yung passport for reference. And then, uh, sila na rin yung nag-book at nagbayad na lang ako. At saka, nagbayad din ako at the same time ng uh, unassisted minor service fee. In exchange of that, merong binigay na documents. Iba-iba sigurong documents na no, nakadepende sa airline. But, for Ethiopian Airlines, they give me this form in four copies. It's called an accompanied minor form, request for carriage, handling advice to parent or guardian of an unaccompanied child. Ayan. So, four copies to and it's supposed to be given to every staff na magre-receive sa kanya sa airport hanggang sa maipasa siya or maibigay siya sa kanyang dad. So, ang only person lang na tatanggap sa kanya ay ang kanyang tatay at wala nang iba. Ayun. Very clear. So, that's what I did for the unassisted minor flight. Medyo kinabahan pa ako nung una guys kasi nga first time ko hindi ko alam kung anong mga preparation. Akala ko kailangan maraming gawin, kailangan maraming documents na i-prepare. Pero hindi naman pala. As long as organized lang yung airline. Ayan. At experience na din yung mga malalaking airline. So, um, of course, in the end, uh, we have to also pray para naman mag-guide yung travel ng ating mga anak. But we are happy that we are doing this. Masaya ako at masaya yung tatay ni Kahil kasi we really want him to be independent. At kung ang pangarap ko man para sa akin at sa mga anak ko ay makapag-travel, this is another way for them to see the world and for them to feel na they can accomplish something on their own kahit na wala ako. Ang kailangan lang, um, confidence, dapat obs observant, dapat observant. Ayun. So, lagi kong kinakausap si Kahil na just observe and do not hesitate to ask. Kasi wala namang mali sa pagtatanong. Yan, lagi kong tinuturo sa anak ko. Kasi, normally, meron tayong mindset na nakakahiyang magtanong. Nakakahiyang mag-ask kesyo, baka sabihin ng tao, hindi ka marunong magbasa, ganito, ganyan. No, it's always uh, okay to ask. And we always start learning from there. So, ngayon, mag-start na tayo sa ating... Wait lang. Alright. 
Check ko lang yung microphone. So, ngayon, mag-start na tayo sa mga inimpaki ko or ano yung preparation ko para kay Kahil sa kanyang uh, first unassisted minor flight. Uh, like I said, this is our first time. And sa mga first time mommies dyan, nagagawin din tong service na to. At least makakuha man lang kayo ng idea or tips kung ano yung ginawa ko. So, first things first, nagsulat ako ng mga kailangan kong gawin. I have this very small notebook. And I have here two pages and what to pack for Kahil. So, sa first part, meron akong what to pack for Kahil in his backpack. And sa, sorry, in his um, funny pack, this one. And the other one is what to put an, in his backpack. So, sinulat ko talaga siya kasi there's a big chance na marami tayong makakalimutan. For me, I don't rely much sa utak ko lang, guys. Kasi makakalimutin ako. That's number one. Number two is... Ayoko ng stress. Ayun. Kung pwede ko lang i-manage yung stress, I will. So, gagawin ko yung mga bagay in advance and I'll make sure na at least organize para naman hindi, na, hindi tayo ma-stress on the day. So, ngayon nga, it's already 11 o'clock and we will be leaving <coughs> papunta ng airport in 2 hours. So, ngayon, eto na yung laman ng bag ni Kahil. Napako na, pero ipapakita ko lang sa inyo. So, the important thing here is his funny pack. Eto which is going to be actually his important things. And I am going to put for him a 100 US dollar bill. Ayun. Bibigyan ko siya ng 100 dollar bill dahil uh, panggastos just in case sa airport. Kung hindi naman, his dad is going to ask him to save it. Actually, meron din akong change nito eh. Maliliit na bills. So, eto ang laman ng kanyang funny pack. Pera. So, why did I put 100 USD? Why did I put US dollar? Kasi kapag ka UGX, mahirap gamitin yung pera ng Uganda. Hindi siya yung well-known na note na euro or pounds or, or US dollar or Canadian dollar. Hindi. Ugandan shillings is not as popular at hindi siya tinatanggap sa mga maraming stops. So, 100 US dollar, ilalagay ko sa kanya ang funny pack, just in case lang na meron siyang gusto or meron mang something, hindi natin ma-isip, right? But, con contingency, yun yung tinatawag nila, for contingency purposes. And, here in the bigger pocket, andito lang yung kanyang important document, which is, ang kanyang yellow vaccine at ang kanyang passport. Passport, of course, alam naman natin kailangan yung passport sa pagta-travel and they take this out a lot of times when you are traveling. So, um, the more accessible it is, the better. So, lagay natin dito. Yellow vaccine is a vaccination na binibigay kapag taga-Africa ka or nakapag-travel ka ng Africa and some other few countries na kailangan mo or required ng yellow vaccine. So, this vaccine is good for 10 years. And Kahil has this already from Thailand. Ayun. So, hahanapin to sa kanya pagdating niya ng Thailand. So, make sure natin na nandyan. So, basically, ilalagay lang yan ni Kahil sa kanyang chest like this. And lahat is easy access. Buksan niya lang. Pakita ang passport. Close. Very good. Then, Okay. Another thing that I'm going to add here is his small toy. Meron siya ditong bri brick game ang tawag namin. <laughs> brick game yung tawag namin dito or Tetris game. Heto lang siya. So when I took him out to buy a few things for himself for this flight, nakita niya to. And it's very good kasi sobrang compact niya lang at sobrang liit. And um, talagang kompleto siya ng games. Ayun. Ay. So, naglaro din ako nito and I was really enjoying. Ito, may meron talaga siyang Tetris na game. Ayan. So, I was really enjoying with this game. There's turn on, turn off button. Kompleto lahat. Marami siyang games na mapagpipilian. Very small. And I'm going to add this one in his funny pack. Para kapag bored siya and um, parang gusto niya lang mag-relax at mag-chill habang nag-aantay or kahit sa airplane. This toy is perfect. Again, this toy is perfect kasi hindi siya nagmi-make noise. And it's small. Ayun. It's not taking space. So, that one for him. Okay, so the funny pack is finished. Now, we have here his backpack, which is an Adidas bag with um, a lot of compartments. Meron siyang space sa front. Merong bigger zipper. 
meron siyang space for laptop, tablet, or file. And of course, water bottle, um, water bottle pocket. Ayun. So, ano nga ba yung ilalagay ko dito? First things first, ay ang kanyang uh, file or ang envelope na merong mga important documents. Nilagay ko dito ang printed copy ng kanyang itinerary. Meron siyang printed copy ng passport and ID ko. Passport and ID ng tatay niya. With contact numbers, sinulat ko din. Meron siyang copy ng kanyang birth certificate, of course. Then, the unassisted minor form. And then, um, pinin ko na din yung mga resibo na mga binayad ko. Ng mga binayad ko sa airline. So, andito lahat. Of course, I also packed for him, guys, ang kanyang old passport. Kasi important ito, eh. Ayan. Kahil has already two old passport from his previous travels na nag-expire na and a copy of his passport size photo. So, yan ang laman ng kanyang file. And I'm going to put that in this bigger, bigger zipper. Another thing that is very important is his own personal iPad which has his videos, some of the games that we prepared para sa flight niya. Nag-download din kami ng mga free videos from YouTube and Netflix na pwede niyang panoorin just in case he's bored and he wants to watch something. Ayun. Siyempre, nandito rin ang contact ng kanyang dad at contact ko for him to be able to contact and call us immediately kapag nakalapag siya ng uh, airport. Ayun. Uh, next nyan is, I also packed for him a pair of clothes to change. Uh, minsan hindi kasi natin naiiwasan, kahit nga tayong mga adults, minsan nagkakaroon tayo ng um, incident na nababasa or nat natatapunan or nasusuka or we feel just we want to be fresh. I packed for him fresh un underpants and a shirt and shorts and socks as well. So that one goes there, of course. Okay, another thing that we prepared for him is this book. Maraming salamat nga pala kay Jem at kay Terosely ng um, Saturn London. Tama ba? <laughs> Saturn London sa UK. Sa mga regalo nyo kay Kahil, one of them is this book that he's going to travel with and two other books. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Ilalagay ko rin yan dito sa kanyang front pocket. Um, of course, another water bottle. Ito ay FIFA guys, sobrang ganda ng water bottle na to. Galing din to kay, Ati, uh, kay Jem tsaka kay Tirosely. And this is FIFA World Cup 2022 water bottle. So maraming maraming salamat, nagustuhan talaga to ni Kahil. At bakit ako magpapak ng water bottle? Kasi water bottles are allowed as long as they are empty. Hindi lang sila allowed kapag merong tubig. So in instances na nasa airplane si Kahil and nauuhaw siya, he can actually ask for water sa mga um, stewardess, ayun, sa mga airline staff, or anywhere sa airport, they can help him. So, I'm going to put this bottle dito sa gilid. Kung, na, kung parang mahuhulog siya, guys, ilalagay ko na lang siya sa loob. Ayan, para sure. Uh, the remaining things here are just his essentials, like his snacks and his soap, toothbrush, toothpaste, and of course, wet wipes. Malapit na tayong matapos. Siyempre, wag natin kalimutan ang mga charger, cord, power bank if meron kayong ipro-provide. But for me, I'm just sending Kahil his original charger para sa tablet niya. Ilalagay ko dito sa harap. Then, everything for cleaning, toothbrush, soap, wet wipes. And yun nga, yung kanyang toothbrush, ilalagay ko sa isang lalagyan lang para hindi siya ma-confuse. Tanggalin na lang kaya natin. He wants to freshen up. Toothbrush, toothpaste, soap at saka wet wipes. Kasi yung soap minsan kailangan sa paghuhugas ng kamay or maghilamos. Gusto niya maghilamos. Ilalagay ko lang sa isang sealed plastic. And then I will put it here on the second pocket as well. Ayan. And lastly ay ang kanyang... By the way guys, I packed for him spare batteries. Para sa kanyang laruan na maliit, just in case maubusan siya ng battery, he can still have fun. So, ilalagay ko lang yung battery sa katabi ng mga charger. Ayun. Last but not the least, o oh, hindi pa. So, and uh, now we are on his, hindi naman mabigat. Mabigat lang talaga yung tablet. 
Now is his snacks. So, sabi ko sa kanya, kumuha siya ng salty, sweet, at saka something heavy. So, for salty, ito ang kinuha niya. Kasi minsan, di ba, pag nag-flight tayo, depende yung panlasa natin. Minsan, kung gusto natin kumain ng kahit naman saan, minsan gusto natin kumain ng maalat, minsan gusto natin matamis, minsan gusto natin yung medyo mabigat sa sikmura, lalong-lalo na kapag medyo natatagalan yung pag-serve ng food. So, for salt, for salty, eto. Uh, ano lang to siya, guys? Potato crisp. Ayun. Uh, made of made of potato talaga. Then, for sweet, he chose skittle. Yung mga maliliit lang, he also got himself a haba baba. He also got himself a haba baba, which is a bubble gum that you can blow bubbles. Fine. Can make him busy. And for something heavy, he got Oreo and chocolate chip cookies. Cookies. Ayun. So, eto ang kanyang snacks na aking ilalagay sa kanyang bag. Fusion. Para sa table. Kasi sabi ko sa kanya, ako kasi hindi ako comfortable sa ganito. Pero sabi ni Kahil, gusto niya daw. So, why not? At tamang-tama, meron siyang clip. So, he can just clip it yeah, in his now bag. how it looks. Ang kanyang travel backpack. Very comfortable. It's not heavy. He's not going to hurt himself carrying this while walking to the next gate. Andito lahat ng kailangan niya. Uh, sa airlines naman, nagpo-provide sila ng blanket and pillow. So, as long as meron siyang jacket, he's good to go. Then, of course, his funny pack. So, eto na, dalawa. Accomplished tayo. Mission accomplished. At uh, sana guys, na may natutunan kayo dito sa unaccompanied minor preparation. And ano yung mga essentials na dapat ipak. If you have any comments, if you have any suggestions, or kung meron man akong nakalimutan, please don't hesitate to comment them down below. Kasi gusto ko, ting, gusto ko tong matutunan for the future. Ayun, syempre marami tayong junanak. Kailangan, na, <laughs> kailangan natin mag-practice ngayon pa lang. Yeah! Alright, so I think we're good. Um, now it's time for us to prepare to the airport. Yep, comfortable. Check inside, open the big zipper. Big... <coughs> You have there your passport and yellow vaccine and your toy. And then the, the next zipper you have? I have dollars! Yes, you're welcome. So that one only for emergency, okay? Because you have everything you need, right? You don't need to spend. If you cannot spend it, tell daddy to save it on your bank. Okay, I have a bank account. Yes, now try the, the backpack on your back. Heavy or not? Not, not heavy, right? Now let's see what's inside so I can tell you. We're going to Entebbe Airport. We have to speak louder. Okay. We have to. We are going to Entebbe Airport. Yes. Pagkunta na kami ng airport ngayon. So, hindi ko kasi nama ang mga bata. Tsaka si Auntie Christine. Dahil mababaw ang mga luha ng all. At ayoko maging moment dito ng, ano, ng iyakan at kalungkutan. Gusto ko maging masaya at excited. Si Kuya Cahill sa kanyang first ever travel alone of course assisted by the airlines right mm -hmm. how do you feel great are you excited yes what what are you looking forward for this travel i'm uh, looking forward to seeing mm. thailand again mm. and then looking forward to see my dad because yes. and i know he's very excited and so am i yes and did you say goodbye to your brothers yeah what was chico doing Chico was sleeping like this, hugging the wall as usual. Oh, he loves the wall. Mm -hmm. Kasi nagpaalam na siya kay Chico, pero tulog si Chico. So, sabi ko magpaalam lang siya. Hindi ko na binidyuhan, guys. Dahil yung mga ganyang moment, gusto ko talagang wala yung camera. At talagang ma-feel ng mga anak ko. And of course, nagpaalam na rin siya kay Kulit Kulot. And kay Kuya Nasri, Kuya Kahil, at sa kanyang friend na si Tem. Of course, Ate Sara and Auntie Christine is there, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, what are you having there? You are you are ready with your easy pack? Yes. And yeah. then my backpack with all my snacks mm -hmm. and the things I need. And jacket. Yeah. So, you will fly from Entebbe Inter International Airport to Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. Okay. Two hours flight. Okay. Okay. Then you will wait in the next... For the next airplane, you will wait for like three hours only. Okay. Just one movie and one game. Alright? Okay. Then, uh, three hours, then you will have eight hour flight to Thailand. Okay. So that's a total of eight plus three, eleven.
plus two, about 13 hours in total, guys, na travel. Yeah, that's one day and one hour. Huh? Yeah. 12? One day is 24 hours. Yeah, but in the night and then 12 hours to morning. Yes. Okay. It's just night to morning, but it's not 24 hours. Not bad. It's like you're going to sleep in the plane. Uh-huh. So what, what do you do in the airplane? Have you planned what you're going to do inside the plane for eight hours? Um, for eight hours, I will be doing uh, playing games and then sleep. And dinner then first? Dinner first. Put your window up. Dinner first. Uh, uh, okay. Uh -huh. Brush teeth. Freshen up. Yeah. What else? And then go sit back and then watch one movie. Go to bed if there's still time. I can be watching some videos and then have a little nap time mm. and then once but, we reach mm. Okay, Kahil? Lagi kong sinasabihan kasi si Kahil at ang mga anak ko actually guys kapag nagbabiyahe ako kasama ang mga bata sleeping time is non-negotiable uh, they can watch the TV the entertainment on the plane they can play on their tablets they can play with toys but sleeping time is non-negotiable at least 6 hours especially sa mga long flight it helps with the mood it helps with the energy at all right Kahil is now ready showing your outfit for airport hey. Oy, your socks are still there <laughs> he's wearing his comfortable shoes shorts and a very smart shirt. With perfume in it. <laughs> May pa perfume. Kasi wala kaming downy. Nagpabili si Kahil ng KFC Tower Burger Spicy for takeout. O, ba? Very specific. Mahilig kasi si Kahil sa spicy. Which level of spicy do you like? Level 1? One? 1 chili, 2 chili, or 3 chili? 2. 2 chilies? Yeah. And did KFC give you the 2 chili last time? No, it gave me 1 chili. I know. But now in Thailand, you're going to eat again spicy, right? Yeah. McDonald's has me and waiting. Naantok na si Kahil. Kasi gabi na sila natulog kagabi. But they slept well in the morning, right? You slept yeah. well in the morning. Yeah. Oh, oh, you woke up early. I woke up early because of the sounds of Adi and Kobe. Okay. Kobe went like... I packed for you. Like, oh. Kobe, I mean, mommy, mommy. I know, Chico Hug. is always like that. Hug. I packed for you sunblock. Kasi guys, masyado siyang exposed sa init, lalo na sa football. You're always playing on the sun, okay? Under the sun. So, always put on what? Sun block. What to if avoid it's raining? Still. To avoid what? The um, uh, premature signs of aging. Katulad niyan, mga linya. Sabi ko nga sa kanya, alagaan niyang mukha niya. Huwag niyang ibaliwalain katulad sa akin. Charo. Ayan, may sample ako sa anak ko. Ayaw niya magkaroon ng katulad ng mga ganitong scar sa mukha. So, he needs to take care of his face, okay? okay. Otherwise, he'll have scars like mommy and it's not nice. All right? I mean, it's nice if you know how to accept it. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. Uh, yes? Mommy, What's your question? You, did you know that when you're in the snow mm. the, and the ice protect you from blindness, they have something here that is white yeah. to protect your eyes? Oh, but that was a snow going there. No, the snow goes to your eyes. And if you stay in the snow within one day, mm. you'll become blind. Mm. One eternity later. Okay. Walking na kami to departure area and we are on time. Kasi alas 6 pa pala yung flight ni Kahil. So alas 3 nandito na kami. That's 3 hours before... before that's 3 hours before departure. Uh, normally, check-in time closes one hour before departure. So, that's a lot of time. Ngayon guys, as an, as, as an assisted minor, titingnan ko kung hanggang saan ko kaya siyang ihatid. Kung pwede tayo makapasok hanggang departure area, much better. Kasi nga, first time natin itong gagawin. So, hindi ko alam hanggang saan lang ako pwedeng maghatid kay Kuya Kahil. Right? Yeah. Okay, guys. Now I'm leaving in Tebe, Uganda. I'm so excited to see my dad, and I hope I can come back and visit again. To do what? 
to visit my brothers and I want Here to see Uganda. how old they could grow they, now. <laughs> they, I wonder what if they'll look different. They'll look different or they will change. Yeah, like when Nazri was me and he was young, we were different. Uh. And then when he grew up, he looked so different from the younger version. Okay. Even Ashley. Let's go inside. So, papasok na kami guys, ni Kahil, and then let's see. I'll keep you guys posted. Binigyan nila ako ng visitor pass. Ayan. Kailangan merong visitor pass muna at isurrender yung ID or passport para makapasok sa loob ng airport kapag hindi passenger. Are you tired yet? No. Hungry yet? Yeah. Buti na lang pala bumili ako ng KFC niya. Kasi mamaya pa yung dinner eh. Alas 8 pa ang dinner. Oh. Remember the last time when you bought me a video eating the biggest gully? Yeah, you finish it like 3 minutes. Like 2 minutes. Yung pang dinner sana ni Kahil ng alas 7, naubos niya na ng alas 4. And that is a tower burger. Okay, you throw while waiting. Nagaantay pa kasi kami guys ng ano, service staff para kay Kahil.